Welcome back here to another episode here today. We are getting in here talking about some changes that are coming to this channel. Some absolutely much needed changes and changes that I absolutely felt needed to be made here. So as you guys know, for the last couple of years, we've been running this YouTube channel off of our PlayStation 4 and our gaming laptop, which have gotten the job done to get this channel up and going, to get it started, to get it to where it is now. But I feel like if we want this channel to grow and we want not only the Arnoggle 9 community to grow, but the Next Car Racing League and every other plans that I have in store for us in the future, if they're gonna work and they're gonna grow, we needed to have some much needed changes. And that is what today's episode is all about, bringing some much needed changes to this channel. So, like I just said, we have been running this channel off the PlayStation 4 and our HP Omen gaming laptop, and they have gotten the job done here for however many years we've been working on YouTube videos, um, doing live streams, doing the next car broadcast, the next car racing broadcast, and it has gotten the job done, but I feel like it has finally reached a point where if the Arnoggle 9 community is going to grow and the next car community is going to continue to get better, especially with the season that we are having right now, we've got 50 some people in the league now, which is absolutely amazing. When we started, we were just cracking 12, 13 people and now we're at 50. And I'll be a little biased with it. I feel like our broadcast and everything that we do on Sunday, the truck series booth broadcast. On Monday, we're in the car, we're racing and everything. I'm gonna be biased, and I'm gonna go ahead and say that maybe what I'm doing has helped bring a lot of people in. You know, people are seeing the videos on YouTube, they're seeing them on Twitch, Facebook gaming. Well, you're only gonna keep people if your content continues to get better. And I feel like we're reaching that point now where our content was starting to get a little stagnant. You know, everything was starting to kind of stay the same. It wasn't improving, but it wasn't taking a step back or anything, but it wasn't getting to the potential or to the point that I think we need to get to. So today, we're changing all of that. We have got some huge news to break to you guys here tonight. So like I was saying, we've been running everything off our PlayStation 4 and our gaming laptop. Like I said, it's the HP Omen. And they have been doing, getting the job done. But it's time to make those upgrades. And today, those upgrades are coming. So, about three weeks ago, I finally entered the draw. I got it done. And I got us a PS5. Now, that is going to truly help a ton with this channel. But that's not the only improvement we've made. We have made some other big improvements, and those improvements just arrived today in the mail via FedEx. I cannot wait to break it to you. If you guys saw my post a day or two ago on Facebook Gaming, on my gaming channel, you guys know we're in for a huge surprise. So, without further ado, let's get into the meat of this video. All right, well, like I just said, we've been running off our PS4 for a while, our gaming laptop as well. We just added the PS5 right there, but it is time to now officially introduce the newest addition to this gaming channel. And here she is, our all new CyberPower PC desktop gaming PC, and she is absolutely beautiful. Cannot wait to get this thing open. Before we do, let's check out your specifications here before we dig into the meat. Uh, you've got your Intel i7 11,700, 16 gigabytes of RAM, GeForce RTX 3060, the Gamer Extreme Series. So, without further ado, let's get into it. All right, we just got her unboxed. We had a very curious dog come in to help us. What's up, Luke? Making your second appearance on a vlog. The first one in the Indian motorcycle video. What's going on, Bubba's? Welcome to the party, big fella. But well, we have got our PC out of the big box. Now it's time to get her all the way open. All right, well, we have got her all unboxed and everything. So there's only one last thing to do with this bad boy. 
and that is to plug her in. All right, we just got her plugged in and everything, and now it's time to hit the main power button. Let's, oh shoot. I know, I'm breaking the cardinal rule when it comes to PC gaming, and I got her down on the carpet for right now. It ain't gonna be down here long, just a little bit here to get this video up and everything, and then she will be up on the desk or somewhere. I haven't really decided on where I'm gonna put her. Don't exactly have a whole lot of room, but I got, you know, got the PS5 there. The PS4 is gonna come off, probably the laptop's gonna come off, so I could possibly try to squeeze her in right there. But I'm gonna try and get another display and everything set up. The lights are absolutely amazing. And it also comes with this really cool remote that you can change everything. So we can make them red. Uh, let's go blue, green. What else we got? We got auto. So then it just goes through everything. This thing is sweet. You can just turn them off, you can turn them on. You got yellow, orange, right there is orange. You got just plain white. You can make them brighter, you can make them dimmer. Yeah, this thing is absolutely amazing. But we're gonna figure out where exactly we're gonna get her set up and everything, and we will be right back. All right, so we finally got her set up down here. Now I got her off, up off the carpet. When I bought this uh, desk, it came with a PC like ledge and stuff with wheels, but I'm not exactly sure where the hell the wheels went. So I at least put the slab of wood that came with it underneath it to at least get it up off the carpet a little bit, maybe help you know keep some of the heat down and stuff. But without further ado, We've got the mouse, we've got the keyboard plugged into her. Let's turn this baby on for the first time with everything hooked up. Our keyboard has come on. Now I'm actually really surprised here, if I'm gonna be completely truthful. The keyboard and mouse, I thought were gonna be kinda cheap. You know, I, I was like, you know, how good is this gonna be? You know, it's coming included with the um, PC and everything. I was like, how good? could these actually be? And I'm gonna tell you what, these are actually some really good uh, mouse and keyboard. I'm I'm pleasantly surprised. You know, you see the LED lights in both and everything, both changing colors, changing everything about them. And I'm actually pleasantly surprised. I'm gonna be truthful, as we got a very curious Loki. What's up, Bubba's? What's up, big guy? But yeah, I'm also gonna break another cardinal rule here when it comes to PC gaming. I don't have anything else to really do it on, so we're gonna have to play on, or not play, but we're gonna have to test everything, get everything set up here on our 55 inch flat screen Samsung TV. I know you're not supposed to do that, but that's what we're gonna have to do this time. But we've got the mouse hooked up, we've got the keyboard hooked up, we've gotta get our microphone hooked up to it, we gotta get a bunch of other stuff, we gotta get Streamlabs OBS downloaded on there. Something that I did mention, I know I mentioned it at the beginning here of the vlog is we're doing a bunch of new, new stuff with this channel. And one of the new things that we are doing, and that is we are gonna be getting into iRacing. That is huge. I know some of y'all might not know what iRacing is. It's about as close to the real racing you can get. It is a simulator and it is about as close to the real deal that you can get and I am absolutely stoked about getting into it. Our laptop that we were running on, it could handle it. But the problem was, is it wasn't allowing me to live stream and record videos and stuff while doing iRacing. It was perfectly fine with the NASCAR Heat 5. You guys saw that. The only unfortunate thing was it was only recording and doing videos in 720. Well now, with this new PC and the PS5, which I ended up moving over here into the corner next to the PS4, obviously the PS5 now is in 4K and it exports videos 1080 and might even do 4K. I'm not completely certain, so I'm not gonna say one way or the other. But with this new PC and the new graphics card and the much upgraded RAM, hopefully now we can do all our videos 
in 1080p, including live streams. So this was a much needed, much wanted upgrade for this channel. Like I said, if we want this channel to grow and not only the Arnold 9 community, but the next car racing league. And like I said, I'm gonna be getting into iRacing. So hopefully that starts to help everything grow. This is a much needed and much wanted improvement for this channel. So this is gonna be absolutely huge. I'm gonna go ahead, I'm gonna get everything set up for this laptop, or laptop, good God, I'm so used to being on the gaming laptop. But I'm gonna get everything set up here for the PC. And once I do, I will probably give you guys a tour of the gaming room. That is something that a lot of the guys in the next car um, racing league, they want a tour of the gaming setup, the gaming room and everything, which I haven't done yet. And this is an ample opportunity to do this now that we have got some major upgrades like i said in the last month it has been huge for this gaming channel ps5 we got a new pc now next thing we got to do is get a monitor once i get the extra money here i'm going to be getting obviously a gaming monitor but i just don't know when but that is going to do it for this one ladies and gentlemen if you guys enjoyed it make sure you're hitting that like button hit that subscribe button and i will catch you guys on the next episode and i will also be dropping another episode here pretty soon with a review on this pc uh we'll be putting a link down in the description down below i bought it from best buy originally 1600 dollars on sale for 1100 so cannot beat that cannot pass that up but like i said that video will be coming out here shortly so make sure you're keeping an eye on on that make sure you're hitting the bell hit the notifications make sure you turn those on so you know exactly when i upload but that is going to do it for this one ladies and gentlemen like i said if you guys enjoyed it hit that like button hit that subscribe button and i will catch you guys next time here on the Arnaldo 9 channel. Have a good one, everybody.